Who allowed Dora to have a live action adaptation? Hmm? Who was it? Who signed off? So many good properties that have yet to be adapted and we chose an explorer from Spain? Or Mexico? I don't know. I'm not up on the lore. Why am I so mad? I don't know. Maybe the fact that my air conditioning won't turn on. And also, I just started cutting my own hair earlier. I have no experience with this whatsoever. And that scares me. So then I stopped. Look at- just look. Look at this little- ooh. Look what I'm gonna do. You know what? I'm gonna defy gravity. I am magnificent because I can defy gravity. What are you doing, hair? Lay down. You know what, hair? You know what? Fall in line. Fall in line, okay? This is what you get. Huh? Take that, hair. I'm gonna regret this tomorrow. Oh my god, are you are you kidding me? We're in a recess, YouTube. Okay, I have the choice of either getting high definition or ultra high definition. How can I make fun of the monkey CGI if I'm just looking at it in high definition? All right, all right, let's do it. Let's do it. $21. Love it. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> you can try to make it look fancy, Nickelodeon, but you and I both know your work is not to be respected. Everything you're about to see is true, except that foxes don't swipe. I'm a talking backpack. <laughs> of course you are. Why do I feel like this is a misdirect? I thought this was like a little bit edgy. <laughs> Can't be it. Yes, I knew it. Early tomorrow. Is that a desperate housewife? Hey, he's a good actor too. He was good in something. I don't know what, but I remember thinking that he's good in this. In something. Mmm, delicioso. Can you say delicioso? De, 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 de. Say delicioso. Do a, I can't do it. God damn it, Dora. Don't challenge me like this on the spot. My God. She, she'll grow out of it. Are they trying to present Dora as like a little child psychopath? Because I can get behind this. If she murders her family, I'll be so excited. Dora explores sociopathy. Dora explores the inside of a human body featuring her family. Oh, do you see intestines? Has golden statues of <laughs> Wait, Do they not have windows? You're in a jungle. What if you're attacked by a fucking leopard? What? Bro. They just let them slow. There's gotta be like malarious mosquitoes. Mosquitoes. M mosquitoes with malaria. Carriers. I don't know how to phrase those. I don't. The, the words. You know all the words. You put them together in the right order, okay? Mosquitoes with malaria. Give the kids malaria because this carriers mosquitoes. You know the words, okay? You do the work. They don't even have fucking doors. My God. What irresponsible parents. Hey, jaguars are way cooler. Monkeys? Facts. Oh, I'm on board with Diego. Jaguars, best animal. Period. And yes, part of that is because I'm a fan of the Jacksonville Jaguars, the football team. But also, if you've looked into the history of Jaguars... Pretty remarkable. Third biggest cat and pound for pound, the strongest cat. They have the strongest bite. They can climb trees. They can swim. Show me a tiger that can climb a tree. You can't, tigers. I know better. I'm older than you. I think you're just yelling at me because you're sad you're leaving. Of course that's why I'm yelling at you. <laughs> you children are not emotionally aware. You're six. That's deep emotional reasoning. These are little children <laughs> therapists. <laughs> Wait, what? Are you Spanish speakers? Te voy a extrañar también, prima. Yeah, prima bien. <laughs> Holy shit. They let a monkey sleep with their daughter? It's a joke here. This is gonna get a little dirty and a little dark. Um, just imagine Dora's 18. This isn't about child Dora. Do you think if... Mm, if the parents caught the monkey having sex with 18-year-old Dora, do you think they'd go, Hey, what's this monkey business? Let's move on. He's got to be carrying diseases. Don't let him sleep with your child. Oh, yes. Finally. So what? Is she, uh, is she 18 now? Can I make adult jokes? And I'm being chased by a herd of angry pygmy elephants. Can you say angry pygmy elephants? 
I wish she got trampled to death. Hi, I'm Dora. Can you say pig meal? Oh, God. Golden poison frog. Can you say severe neurotoxicity? Severe, severe. I couldn't say your first word. Stop challenging me, Dora. I'm not smart. Oh, thank God. Oh, no, take it away. I thought they were gonna carry him away and eat him. God, all these almost deaths are pissing me off. Can you kill her off, please? I won't know anyone there. Why is... That's a goddamn snake. I missed you guys so much. Ah! Diego's gonna be too cool for her. I hope he's too cool for her. You are way more energetic than I remember. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Be a moody teen. Hey, don't alter your character from what my expectations are. What is that? The candy bar that we split before you left the jungle. Remember? Uh, oh my god. This girl has psychological problems. I love it. I just want you to have a good first day. Oh, he cares. Oh, and if I don't talk to you, don't take it personal, okay? We're all just trying to survive high school. So ah! Atta boy, dish her. What is this? A flare, in case of emergency. Oh! <laughs> Damn it. Damn it! Don't laugh. Hi, I'm Dora. Cool shirt. Whoa. Oh, I could tell by his haircut that he's the love interest. I'm pissed. I'm fucking pissed. God damn it, Dora. Why him? Dora, explore your dating options, not this guy. Guy, guy, though, let me help. Let me help. Beat headphones? How much did they pay you? I know they've chipped in 50K, minimum. You don't accidentally put products into your movies. You cover them up and make them pay you, and if they don't pay you, then you don't give it to them for free, because then the next time you make a movie, they wouldn't pay you. They'd just be like, no, let's just not pay them, and then. The They'll just do it for free again. But if you're going to take a shot at the queen, you better not miss. I'm watching you. They're gonna be friends by the end of this. Bet on it. Place you gotta go. I'm the one you. Oh, there's slow children on the street. Can you identify the slow child on the street? Hi, I feel the need to explain myself because that joke is funny to me. But it's only funny to me because. Only I was stupid enough not to understand something. So you know that sign, that slow children sign? To me, I always thought that that meant that there were mentally handicapped children present on this street and you need to slow down because they may unpredictably run into the streets. But no, that's not what that sign meant. It means that slow down. There are children present, children of all mental capacities. But there's no comma, there's no comma after slow. So when I see slow children, I just assume that there are children with less mental faculties present. I, is this not hard to understand? All my life, that sign meant one thing and then all of a sudden it just clicks. What happened there? Decided to leave it in though, cause it's funny that I'm stupid. Call me when you can. Our parents aren't responding to her. Oh, they ditched her. I would too. Now her parents went missing. She's got to go find them and rescue them. Not hard to figure out because I am a professional movie watcher. That's the reason you didn't figure that out. I know you didn't know that. Can't really dance, but I can hold my breath for seven minutes though. Holy shit. It's Disco Dorka. <laughs> if she turns everybody to do the same dances that she's doing and she conquers this high school. I don't know what I'll do. I'll probably chop off some more of my hair <laughs> because uh, it's starting to make me feel a little crazy. And it was hard enough already without having to take care of the class weirdo. God damn it, Diego. Her fucking parents are missing. Dick. Can I be on your team? Do you guys need a fourth person? Yeah. Hey guys. Oh my God. If these four end up in the jungle together, I can't, I can't. I really can't. Oh, God. I can't with these two. You know how to make this film better? I'll do it right now. Do you see what I did there? You made it better. Of course this is happening. Uh, can you say that again? I couldn't quite get that. Of course this is happening. Do you guys know what he's saying? Of course this is happening. I, I wish that he would be a little bit more audible. 
Speaking of which, I got something to tell you guys. This video is sponsored by Audible. If you've watched me for any length of time, you know that I've worked with Audible in the past. I love the service that they provide. Just hours and hours of entertainment, scores of audiobooks, just an incredible library. And of course, if you use my code audible.com slash Dylan is in trouble, there will be a link for it in the description. You will get a 30 day free trial. And one cool thing that Audible is doing is that they are now opening up their Audible originals to unlimited downloads a month. That is on top of one free audiobook every single month. A friend of mine actually just hit me up about this book called The Rage of Dragons. Him and I are gonna do a buddy listen on that. Apparently the, the original author was self-published on that book and then it did so well that a publisher picked it up and now it's uh, now it's an audiobook and I wanna listen to it. Again, it's audible.com slash Dylan is in trouble. I love working with Audible. It is genuinely a really good service. They just have so much entertainment and it's entertainment that you can consume in the background. So you don't have to always be like super focused on it. You could be cleaning your house, cleaning your car. They've really cornered the cleaning entertainment market in my mind. <laughs> Big shouts out to Audible. Thank you so much. Now let's get back to Dora exploring things. Oh my gosh, could you be any boss here? Excuse me? What's next? Shrill? Or am I being too difficult for you? You left that out of your misogyny 101 class. <laughs> oh my god, don't. I'm just, I'm just trying to unwrap this. They're trying to make this girl unlikable, right? Let's unblur her face so that we can all look at how unlikable she is. They tried to make her the, I'm gonna make you out to be a misogynist so that we dislike her. And this is a kid's movie. So they're trying to tell kids that men are not misogynists if they think a woman is bossy, which I don't know how, what to do with that information. <laughs> Usually children's movies in Hollywood are very like progressive. To have the current villain of the story say that is so fascinating. And I'm not gonna provide any commentary on it. I'm just gonna put it out there for you to consume. I just wanted to point at it. You do the looking and you do the judging. I'm not taking any backlash for anything that I'm saying. I cannot be held responsible for the things that I say. I've already done the monkey sex thing and there was a child involved. I am at my limit of controversy for this video. Anything Egyptian would be the oldest relic by far. Oh, I don't, I don't like this. I don't like this. You were looking at the Egyptian? I, okay. Sometimes people in the comment section, and when I say sometimes, I mean a lot of times, people in the comment section, they say, Dylan, you're so good at knowing movies. You're so good. Look at all my comment sections. That's always the top comment. Every single video. Watch this shot. Just watch how your eye is drawn to this random lady. We don't know if she's gonna have a speaking role yet. Watch, see? She makes eye contact with the main character and she's like the focus of the shot. You know that she's gonna have some sort of minor role, but also she's gonna like propel the story just from the shot. You can tell, this is by the camera work. When does it open? Oh, that's the problem, two weeks. Look, if it means that much to you, there may be a way for you to get down there. <laughs> I'm, this woman's a villain. This woman's a villain. I had to turn the ceiling fan on. You know what, I'm gonna turn it up in the setting. <laughs> Look at how she's winking at us. Look at the wink on this woman's face. You know it. You know it, I know it, you know it. If this woman's not a villain, then I am not a professional movie watcher. This best not be some wild goose chase. I sure hope it is. I love chasing wild geese. I was Until gonna make the fucking geese joke. I just couldn't think of it, God damn it, Dora. She's gonna be kidnapped or something. Hola, Dora. Hi, I'm Dora, and- They're villains! <laughs> hey, 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 I guess a children's movie. I shouldn't be this excited, but fuck it. You gotta take your victories when you can have them, you know? Oh, oh no! No! I knew that was coming too, I just didn't say it yet. I felt the connection between them, but in a really gross way. Man, I would rather him get with the monkey. Dora, I'm a friend of your pants. I'm rescuing you, Dora. Get them! My parents did not. <laughs> That's how you decided the show, that the truck was coming to an abrupt halt, huh? Get them! Hit the brakes! Really? Were you going three miles an hour? That was the fastest stop. You got some powerful brake pads on that goddamn truck. Not sign a permission slip for the job. Don't trust this man. By the way, don't trust this man either. This is this is what children movies think they're fucking gonna outsmart children. They're like, oh, we have our set villains, and then we have a new guy, and he says he's a friend. 
He must be a friend because we already have the villains, but he's a different villain that'll all be revealed in the third act. I, I'm ahead of your movie, or I'm not a professional movie watcher. If you were a real friend of the parents, he would have been introduced before... Let me finish that thought. If you were a real friend, he would have been introduced before all of this plot started, right? They wouldn't just introduce him saving her, right? That would come out of nowhere. That would make no sense. Also, you can't just call for a fox. Why is this fox wearing gloves and a mask? But he's got some pretty eyes though. Hey, Swiper, you can swipe right on me. There's dirtier ones that I wish I would have done. Swiper, you can swipe my virginity. My bestiality virginity? That's too far. Oh, she's a parkour queen. Oh my god, did I just fall in love with Dora? She just did parkour on the level of a black belt. How are parkour masters? Do they have belts? That doesn't seem right. That's a that's a karate thing. Man, I'm stuck upside down. Why did that feel a little bit racist? The fox is just a fox. And he's just speaking regularly, and then all of a sudden he's like, I stalk upside down. Man, I stalk upside down. That felt really racist. And a fox with a mask. Like, why does that fox need to remain anonymous? Who is going to recognize one specific fox? Dora's got good comedic timing. The parents have good comedic timing. This lady does not. Your parents and I were in constant contact during their time here. No. Did you see his bandana? He's a crip. He's a gangster. I don't believe, don't believe anything he says. Yeah. Hello? Man one one? Can you please come and get us? We're at the corner of rain and forest. A family symbol. <laughs> Red circle. There's no need to overreact. Ah! 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 Get it off! Get it off! Get it! Mm -hmm. That would have been funnier if he got his voice up higher. Like that. I found one of those red loops. <laughs> Who calls it a loop? It's a circle, you psychopath. I found a red loop. <laughs> See how they rushed it? Yeah. <laughs> no, point it out to me. How does it look rushed? Oh, follow me. They hit me. I'm bleeding out. I'm yes, yes. Oh, no, they just hit his backpack. He's fine. Home. I want to be staring at my phone in an ice cold room drinking a frozen coffee <laughs> beverage. I hate it here. Those people that just shot arrows at you? Scream loud so they can come find you. Good idea. You know what? I'm actually not angry because I literally want this girl to die. Freak out sometimes. It's really okay no. to totally freak More. out. Stones! <laughs> Just that, can you show emotion on your face? <laughs> you know an actor is good? when they're not saying anything, they're just saying it with their eyes. And this man just, he looks dead inside. I think he's supposed to be feeling something right here with the, the music swelling. I guess he did a little thing with his mouth, like. <laughs> Actually, I'm here to avoid getting yelled at. It's scary to be responsible. <laughs> How uncomfortable can you make somebody? You know what? I have a story. I'll keep it brief. So when I was in Los Angeles, I was like, it would be a wasted opportunity if I didn't go to some auditions. So I went to one audition. I was playing like the friend of the main character. Or that was the role at least. And I had a line and then he had a line. And I couldn't say my next line until he said his line in the middle. So I said something like, uh, the days are getting long. And then his character, he was staring out at the sea because we were stranded on an island. And he just stared and I just was like, Bro, say your fucking line. It was at least 30 seconds. And I'm just revving up, preparing to say my next line. And he just won't say it. And I'm so uncomfortable, I didn't know where to look. Do I look at his face? Do I look out at this fictional sea? Which is just the, the people watching our performance? Cause that's uncomfortable, I don't know where to look. So I just stared at his face. I'm like, bro, let's move this scene along. Watch Diego here. He's gonna say his thing, and then he's gonna stare like I did as an amateur actor on his first audition ever. Actually, I'm here to avoid getting yelled at. He's just waiting for her next line. Look at the psychopath. He's like, say it, say it. Is it? Bro, 
the eye contact is a little too intense. And please don't ever say the word mating again. Yeah, especially now with the monkey around. We know you shared a bed. Phantom of the upper Shut the fuck up. You're being trailed by two different peoples who want to kill you. I ate a lot of frijoles and chimichangas. <laughs> Chili con carne. <laughs> Would it be a children's movie without some extended fart jokes? Gotta, you gotta love it. You gotta love it. They kind of look like siblings. Ew. I can picture their babies. They look just like them. Spread your genetics. Don't touch anything. Bro, go around. If... Touching something is dangerous. Oh, we all know you're gonna touch it too. Yes, we did it. Oh, she's what? tripping. Oh, what? oh. <laughs> Don't need these goats anymore. Oh, <laughs> did a grown man just throw his his pants into a child's face? Sometimes a song's the best idea. <sighs> did I not say the friend thing? They'd be friends by the end of this. My lips feel chapped. Don't look at them. Don't look at my lips. Don't look at my lips. Where, hey, hey, stop. Yeah, that's what I thought. Well, great. Now we're stuck in a hole. At what point do you stop complaining? At what point are you just like, okay, this is our situation now? Can somebody please tell me what's going on? Where's the villain? Where's the bad guy? They didn't show the guy yet. Alejandro saved us from them. Your old friend. Alejandro, you sent him your journal. My journal was stolen days before the expedition. Oh. This is Alpha Leader. Oh. Don't know him. Oh, there is a shocker. But you can't get inside. It's impenetrable. <laughs> impenetrable. Nothing's impenetrable. Ask the monkey. Ooh, that was dark. It's a holy nightmare. So just shut up. Shut! This man is just not good for this role. He's not over the top enough for a children's movie. How has this not been discovered? It's real. It's so big. You should be able to catch it from satellite or something. Look up. It's a whole city. You're not a kid. But you're not a grown-up either. Why is his voice so deep? You can't do it by yourself. Good you news your friends. is you have friends now. <laughs> no, no, Boots was talking to me. Maybe she hit her head. I'm guarding. Would you stop singing? It's unprofessional. How are we gonna get past him? Well, I saw... okay. So there are talking animals. They can understand the fox and they can talk to the fox and say stop singing. They're surprised when Dora's like, oh, the monkey talked. I don't... I, what is the logic here? There must be a way to open the gates from the outside. Parkour up it. That's what I would do. Constellations. Classic us. Again. This is... Littering much? <laughs> this is a ancient sacred temple. Maybe just pocket that. It's closing! Everyone run! Ah! Try and pull it open! Ah! Yeah, stop thousand pounds of stone. Oh, Boots. <laughs> Good job. It's boring. It's so boring when you know no one's gonna die. Just sacrifice one of them and I'll take everything more seriously. Make an offering of that which is most revered. Thanks for getting through the tough stuff for me. Is he the offering? I think he's gonna die. They want an offering. I knew that you would follow us in here, and I knew that you would let us take all the risk for you. I knew the final Inca test would carry dire consequences for those who should fail it. Which is why we are over here, and you, well, you're standing right there. Did we all just see what happened there? Dora literally <laughs> sacrificed, oh my God. Dora, I love you. I'm in love with Dora. It wasn't accidental. No, 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 no. She knew that the floor was gonna cave out and kill him and that he would be the sacrifice. She sacrificed this man's life. Dora, kill the person. 
this is the greatest. I I was not expecting this. I always crave death in children's movies. And not any of that he accidentally falls to his death. This is Dora planning this man's death. I'm still alive! Oh no! My mercenary is underway! This isn't over yet! God. Damn it! I literally just lost my shit praising you and you just you're gonna reverse all of it. Look at these guys, that's a real problem. Honey. <laughs> oh, I wish she was in more of this movie. He's funny. Excuse me? Where are they looking? The action's going on like straight ahead and they're just like Say goodbye to your little friend. Adios, loser. So if you just touch the monkey statue, the whole building collapses? I I I why would they even set an architecture structure like that up? <laughs> Okay, I guess even touching that thing can cause weather storms. What? What? Well, it can reverse time too. Look, I know we weren't exactly friends when this trip started, but I. I like you too. Ew. What if he, he said friends, girl? What if he's like, hey, a sexual assault? I did not ask for that. I did not consent to that. Up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, bet, bet. Okay, let's make one last prediction. The parents are gonna be like, you know what, it was a mistake to split you up and make you go to the States. Come back and be an explorer with us. And she's gonna say, nope, I wanna go with my friends and live in the States. Fucking bet, otherwise I am not a professional <laughs> movie watcher. We're going back into the jungle in a few weeks. And? We'll be gone for a few months, no contact. Me and your mom. And you. And you. Fucking called it! We're halfway there! We are halfway there, baby! About that. <laughs> I think I want to go back to the city. <laughs> and it's indigenous people. You're a fucking joke to me. Movie, you are a joke to me. It's your fucking amateur hour here, bro. What am I watching? What am I watching? they're joined if they're joined by the student body that was the one thing that was the literal one and only thing that i can remember don't point out any other things that i missed but that was the one big thing that i was like i thought that it was gonna happen i thought she was gonna turn the school to her side i thought she was gonna conquer the school now she's doing it. It's just the post-credit thing. I gotta give the movie props for getting this many extras though. They A lot of times when they're at like a high school dance, it's never near the normal amount of kids that like at an actual school dance. Together, <laughs> this isn't quite organized enough. Look at this. Look at this shot. Everyone is just doing something different. <laughs> This is not choreographed very well. <laughs> Another big thank you to Audible for sponsoring this video. Audible.com slash Dylan is in trouble. A friend and I are going to be listening to The Rage of Dragons. So if you guys want to listen as well, follow along. Let me know what you guys think of it. That's going to wrap this one up. I hope you enjoyed it. I love you guys. I hope you take care. You can kind of see the booty, can't you?